Hello, I'm Sean and I'm the Autistic Naturalist and today I have just found one of my first marsh orchid uh, which is down here it's, uh, a bit of a clumsy, right, there you go, right this is an early marsh orchid now it belongs to a family uh, scientifically known in the genus uh, Dactyloriza uh, dactyl meaning finger like and riser meaning roots and uh, so dact um, finger like roots and uh, this family is notoriously tricky to identify uh, to separate because there are loads of family uh, loads of species and they tend to hybridize with one another making things ten times hard for me and uh, yeah I'm hoping this is indeed a, a mar uh, an early marsh orchid because sorry hang on because the uh, flowers have little their sepals poking up upright like little bunny ears so I don't know if you can see it very well. There you go. There's the bunny ears. And on a marsh orchid, they tend to have plain green leaves, though they do hybridize with uh, the spotted orchid, so they can have little spots on the leaves. If they <laughs> And uh, yeah, there's a also to add to the mix of confusion there's several subspecies of uh, some of these uh, particular species and this is one of them uh, the early marsh has like four subspecies ranging from pink to bright red and uh, yeah this is the pink variety so now all I've got left to do is get my sorry, hang on, sorry. Oh, get my ah oh, okay to get my no, uh, sheet out and tick it off the list as see Oh, it's difficult doing the solo. There we go. Off the list. And till next time. Bye bye.